Hey, real quick video here. If you're going out this summer and you're looking to pull a camper, I've got a 2006 Toyota Sequoia here, and I'm going to be pulling a camper once the snow melts, which might be a while. But in any case, I'm out here on my driveway, and I bought this clip-on towing mirror from Fit System. And there were a lot of expensive mirrors out there. I didn't want to spend an arm and a leg. So I've got this. Uh, here's what it looks like. Basically, it just goes on your mirror like that. And then the ratchets comes with a couple of ratchets and those just attach around the back. So it looks pretty universal. You can adjust these top pieces here. They pivot up and down. And then the same with that bottom piece and the mirror also pivots. So it should be pretty slick. The ratchets are really nice. I've only got uh, two hands so I can't uh, film that but maybe I'll do a quick after here in just one sec. All right, so I've got one side on there and you can see it clips on up there. It's, that's just a cover. This is the quick release to let go of the uh, ratchet system. So if you push that, it'll loosen up. If you want to tighten it, just do that. You can see it's connected down. Just clips in right there to the mirror. And then the front side of the mirror, it's pretty adjustable. Like I said, these go up and down. So I think it fits a lot of different mirrors. I'll put the link at the bottom so you can see it on Amazon. It should... Like I said, it should fit most cars, and if you're towing something, it's probably a good idea to be able to have that extra mirror on the outside. So I'll let you know how it goes, if there are any updates. Um, see if we can just show you maybe with one hand how to install it. So bear with me here if it gets a little shaky, but I'm going to lift up that black thing. I've already got it attached to the top, which is right there. And then we just push this quick release. Maybe. Just holding that quick release down. Don't want to go too far. Go a little bit farther. Or you'll run out of strap. And then, like I said, you just connect that onto there. So I'll just put the phone down for a sec. And within that short amount of time, you can see it's connected. And then all you gotta do is ratchet it on until you're happy. Like I said, this is this is pretty soft plastic here. These straps are just plastic straps. It, I mean, these are nice because I think they help grip. These, if you were concerned about your mirrors, you might want to put something on the bottom of or make sure your mirrors are clean. Otherwise, it could scrape. So hopefully that's helpful. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you on the road. Thanks for watching. All right, here it is going down the road. You can see there's a car in the back and it's riding nice. We're going 60 miles an hour. There's no vibration. It looks awesome. So put the link down at the bottom. It's a really nice mirror. I get it. All right, hey, one last thing on this mirror. I was gonna say, when I first did it, I said you could only adjust it this way or this way, left or right. You can adjust it up and down. It's adjustable all the way. It just, it's a tight adjustment, which it's probably designed that way, so it's not going to be vibrating. So, yep, you can adjust it every way you want it. And uh, like I said, it's a really nice mirror. Man, it, it just, it fits. It's inexpensive. Um, highly recommend it. So, happy camping, and we'll see you on the road.